guys welcome or welcome back to my channel today I have my wax picks for the month of November before I go any further I will show you what is on my nails it looks black but it's actually a really dark purple it is a devil's advocate from Essie so that's what I have on my nails all right so this is a lot as I said before I actually went through quite a lot uh, in the my October mel monthly melts I still have that you're gonna see some repeat some of the things I didn't go through in the month of October I'm putting into this basket I'm gonna try to get through as much pumpkin scent as I possibly can in this month but of course I've pulled other things and again I'm not gonna melt all of this but I want to be able to pick from a lot of different things that I whatever you know I feel um, that kind of thing so um, yeah we'll start from there this is a, one of my it's a mirror that I bought last year from HomeSense and I love it so you can sort of see the wax over here hey way over here um, <clears throat> so anyway we'll start off with the chopped up candles from Bath & Byrics I have here a Bath & Byrics a warm apple pie or WAP I've selected this one to melt next one is a wine cellar the last chopped up candle from Bath and Body Works I have that I pulled is the Mocha Latte Swirl which was awesome love that one and now we'll go on to it this was a big loaf that I have cut up it was a custom from Hayden Rowe, Coconut Cream Pink Sugar Lavender Feel. And what this was, it was in chunks. It was the pink sugar chunks, lavender chunks, and coconut cream overpour. So I have this huge bag left. And we'll do some Sassy Girl Aroma chunk bags. Just trying to get through them. There's some of them that our dates are coming up to about a year and I wanted to use it up. So we've got raspberry jam, toasted marshmallow, candy corn, creamy coconut milk. This one was so good. Rose jam cotton candy, sorry, rose jam cotton candy, tea and cakes marshmallow, and then in tiny, tiny print it says, a soft floral blend of rose petals with a touch of vanilla, orange, and almond tea cakes with a something of steaming black tea blended with sweet marshmallows with a sponge sugar Strawberry and vanilla, I think is what it says. Anyway, it's super small. But anyway, I got, I've only got a, two chunks, but they are two huge chunks left. I have the Jazz Singer from Sassy Girl Aroma. A great bathroom scent. I love this one. Um, I only have three chunks left, but they are large chunks. Uh, Black Sea, Salty Sea Air, Sweet Lavender, Marshmallow, described as Plum, Ozone, Vanilla Amber, Salty Sea Air, spray seaweed unearthed driftwood water lily sweet lavender and ooey green marshmallow sorry I'm trying to read this god those send out descriptions are lengthy all right we've got strawberry rhubarb which is one of my favorites um huge chunks left there's three big chunks again uh it is a fall favorite of mine all right now let's go to since you can see it here Oh no, you can't anymore. I blocked everything. Okay, let's go to Better Homes and Gardens. Again, you're going to see some repeats here of items that probably you remember from last month. But we have warm apricot cider. I was trying to get through a lot of pumpkin scents last month. I'm going to have a few left to do this month, but that's okay. Fall into autumn. A thankful harvest. Wild Berry Cheesecake, Banana Pumpkin, oh sorry, Banana Pumpkin Bread, Crisp Fall Leaves, Pumpkin Butter Cookies, Pumpkin Maple Syrup, Salted pistachio sorbet, pink sugar berry, 
pumpkin berry tart. Sweet candied apples. Winter berry zest. Warm tobacco leaf. Suede cinnamon woods. And this is the A, what would you call this? A dual scented. So half of it is winter cuddle and frosted mint is the other half. So this is a dual. I'm just gonna put that right there. On to sensationals. We have welcome. Jasmine tea, which is I think a Canadian exclusive because this is the American exclusive of tea time and they are two different scents. Honey crisp cider. Applewood. Pumpkin apple muffins. Pumpkin marshmallow cream. This is from Canada. This is last year, 2016. I love this so much. This is sugared cranberries. And berry spice. That's a dual as well. So half of it, sorry, is cranberry chutney. The other half is spruce. Just put that underneath. All right, so now we're gonna go into odds and ends and shots and all that fun stuff. So I might as well start with Sassy Girl here because I have a few odds and ends from Sassy Girl. From my friend in Florida, she sent me a, this here. It's vanilla custard toasted pistachio honey almond sugar cookies. So she just wanted me to try it and um, give my opinion on what I thought about it. And from another friend, I've got Sassy Girl Aroma's Pink Sugar Love Spell. Two things I love in wax. We have Coffee House Coconut Milk Espresso Pizzelle Dark Chocolate. Um, this is going to be definitely a weekend blend for me on the on those cozy weekends home. It smells like coffee. Um, redoing this one again. Ice cream scoop bread from Sassy Girls, an older one. It's the IHOP. Um, I've melted some of it. It was good, but I wanted to pass it through again to the next month. All right. Oh, two more things. Little scent shots. You'll notice there's a lot of little scent shots and things that are going to be one-timers, which I think will be nice because... It, it is a lot of wax, <laughs> but it'll be one, not as bad, I think. I hope. Chocolate chip cookies, Noel birthday. Those are the little free samples that you get. Sassy girl again. Still sassy girl is cranberry, excuse me, hiccups, cranberry apple marmalade. That's that over there. Okay. So I got a large order from, or I think a fairly large order from Candy Panda. So I have to melt candy pandas a full shot at a time. That's just how it works in my house. So I've got Freak in the Sheets, and that is Love Spell, sorry, Love Spell and Laundry. Sweet Dreams, Pink Sugar Lavender, Marshmallowine. London Fog, which I love a good London Fog. Oh my gosh, it's such a great uh, comforting drink. Creamy Vanilla and Earl Grey Tea. Pink Lady, which is Pink Chiffon and Pink Sugar. Old Statues. Mahogany Blood Orange, Cognac, Patchouli, Musk, and Vanilla. All right. So I've got some mandala melts. I've got a whole bunch of stuff coming to me soon. Uh, there was a pre-order and I think it, by the time, no, maybe within a few days of probably posting this video, I should be getting an advent calendar and a whole bunch of stuff. So um, I wanted to melt some of the things this month, just some small little things. So we have from uh, mandala melts, we have Stitch, which is blackberry jam and sugar cookie. King. Uh, King Triton, which is a vanilla tobacco warm like dad's. I, don't, I think I got that from the central description. So I'm going to say like warm like dad's tobacco. Not that my dad smokes tobacco, but um, let's see. Jasmine. Look at those cute embeds there. That is described as lavender and laundry. 
All right. Tiffany's. I've got a few things from Tiffany's. I've got some chunklets in pink, sorry, pink berry and tonka bean with sweet milk overpour. So I have that. This is a gift from a friend and it did melt because it was uh, in the summertime and I'm going to read it for you because it's barely visible. And I find that Tiffany's labels do this. Same with Make Sense Candles, a Canadian company as well. This is a rosemary mint and cactus and sea salt. This is probably from her sea salt sampler. So a friend of mine gave that to me, which I'm still, I'm looking forward to melting. Uh, pumpkin pie spice. So that's what I have from Tiffany's. Uh, again, a company I think is highly underrated, but I think is gaining in popularity. I like it because you can do your own blends and they're always open and you can get everything you want and it's very inexpensive in my eyes considering some places and great throw once you give a few months. That's Sugar and Spice Soy Candle Company. So this one is in Peppermint Lavender Mallow, Vanilla Lavender, Macintosh apple, or sorry, Mac apple and marshmallow. See here, that was that. Some destination wax. I have French green tea. A friend of mine sent me this. This is tonic. And black and black. And a couple of L3s both sent to me by a friend. This is fresh raspberry little heart and love spell downy April fresh which was very nice thanks Beth I'm looking forward to trying those I have a couple of zapes I've already melted one of these really cool looking it's actually four different melts there there's a hat glasses mustache and um, bow tie this is two 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 one B Baker Street which is described as Salty tobacco leaves, warm caramel, and vanilla sugar, reminiscent of the leather and wood inside Sir Sherlock's house. So I've already melted one, one of the full set here, and it didn't throw very well, but it was fairly new. So I'm going to hopefully maybe melt this towards the end of November, so I give it a full month of cure time. The next item I have here is Haunted Mansion, which is, sorry, which is uh, autumn leaves and fall breezes and spider webs and squeaky doors. So look at that melt. It looks really cool. I'm doing that. All right. Let's do the bathing garden. So for those of you who don't know, I did purchase two of the bathing garden um, fall samplers. And I, so I, kept, I bought the second one and I sold it to a Canadian because, uh, of course, uh, it's very difficult for us Canadians to get um bathing garden because they don't ship to canada so but what i did do is i pulled some of the items from the one i kept this is tombstone dust green apple cinnamon cupcakes with uh, marshmallow brown sugar and caramel glaze just a nice one timer again you're gonna there's a lot of like one timers which is great so that means i'll just go through them faster this one here is death becomes her Sponge sugar, vanilla butter, cream, pink sugar, peppermint cookies, rock candy chips. Dr um, Pig and Moon. I actually have this a couple of these in full clams already. Um, Apple M Pear Grove Under a Blood Red Strawberry Moon Kissed by Swirling Fall Leaves. Fairy Bonfire. Which is bonfire with leaves and vanilla, sandalwood, and brown sugar. Oh, this is going to be a long video. Sorry, guys. Netherward, Netherworld Zombie. This is that dirt scent that I think is actually pretty cool. Dirt, espresso, lime essential oils, whiskey, and chocolate shavings. Poisoned Apothecary. Hot, hot mold apple cider with a woody undertone. Banshee Dreams. Frosted pumpkin cupcakes, rich dark espresso, crystallized coconut sh shavings, and white vanilla marshmallow. My own handwriting. Oh my goodness. Haunted hayride. Granny Smith apples, caramel, cinnamon, pumpkin, and hints of hay. Phantom queen. 
black such as tea, cinnamon, coffee, and a bag full of Halloween candy. Whoops, I'm just throwing them around. My apologies, guys. Let's see here. Let's really see a little bit more. There we go. This is and Persephone, Persephone? Is it Glades and Pers I don't remember what the Citrus, cognac, musk, hints of patchouli, and fresh ozone. And then I have some clams here, some of which I've already I've dived into a few, and others I haven't tried yet. Um, two of which I'm going to start off with. I give gave two pieces to my mom, so she's the reason why I'm missing two is my mom got one. Cranberry fig. This is on her winter collection. I want to melt it to see. Tart cranberry is balanced with sweet figs and a touch of citrus. And this one as well. Raspberry stockings. Two gone because I gave two to my mom. A uh, bottom layer of sweet floral vanilla and ripe strawberries topped with a layer of raspberry vanilla ice cream. Frosted snow angels. Picked this up last February. Uh, white chocolate dipped caramel pears layered over pink sugar cookies. This is also available on her site right now in the winter collection. As well as this one, which is my absolute bay. Like, this is my absolute favorite winter palace. French lavender, winter berries, vanilla, pomegranate, strawberries, ice peppermint. I, I see peppermint and a tea and pink sugar. This is fabulous, you guys. And Brenda, I know you bought like a whole bunch. I really don't think you're going to be disappointed at all. Circus cake. I decided to melt this one. I know it's not circus time or anything, but felt like it. So blue raspberry shaved ice, powdered sugar, and a white vanilla ve uh, velvet cake. And I think that was in my melting basket for October. I just didn't get to it. And oh, I can't wait. I think she might come out with this maybe in the early spring for like Valentine's Day. Rose glaze. This is the one that smells just 100% rose jam. This is rose petals, citrus, strawberry, vanilla, and, and geranium. This is, I did the rose jam wax melt off, and this performed the best and had the most, it was perfect. It was just rose jam to, to a tea. All right, so I'm gonna have to move things over here. All right, so I've got some Goose Creek. I've got sugared cinnamon donuts, sweet banana bread, Cookie dough bites, banana pudding. Look at that picture. My God, it looks so yummy. We got Macintosh apple, blackberry bourbon, peanut butter sugar, and that's it for Goose Creek. Now let's go to Rainbow Melt. So I just had to bring everything over. Probably see me in the mirror there. Hey. All right. So we have rosemary melt, the infamous zucchini jam, cranberry zucchini and strawberry jam filled donuts. This is to die for heavenly, love it. I'm so glad I have some in my collection. Uh, cookie heaven, which is gourmet sugar cookies, Danish butter cookies and vanilla butter fudge. I've melted one of these before too. This is amazing. I have a sample that I've never tried this before. It's her, it's a sleepy head, which is sweet lavender vanilla with hints of soothing mint. So I'm looking forward to trying that. I received that as a sample. And we have vanilla tobacco, warm vanilla and fresh pipe tobacco. So, oops, sorry. So that's, this is a huge bag. All right, there's that. Um, okay, we're on to super tarts, folks. I'm gonna bring them all over. Like I said, it's a lot. <laughs> okay. Again, there's some repeats that I didn't get through last month. Jaws, <laughs> which is, oh, small printing. Sea salt, fresh air, seagrass, sliced plum and sweet pear. Gamora, pink sugar mac apple ice cream scoop bread, fake and bake, which is like a zucchini and cream and all that stuff. It's just not written on here. I've got a bam coming in that. Misery, which is pie crust and leaves. I'm gonna pull the camera back here. Oh, oop, or not drop you. <laughs> All right, we have Umbridge, which is tea and cakes, sugar, dusted roses, and cotton candy. La Push from the Twilights, which is fresh raindrop, sage leaf, and orange peel. Harley Quinn, pink sugar and blackberry jam with vanilla sugar waffle cone. Bellatrix, pink sugar and trick cereal type. 
The Mist. Ocean Water, Storms, Rain, and Rosemary Mint. Which I don't get any Rosemary Mint whatsoever in that one, but you never know when it's melted. Go to Sleep, which is pink sugar blended with our sweet lavender cream. Bloody Face, Blood Orange, Rain, and Pink Sugar. Tonks, Magically Delicious, Raspberry, and Pink Sugar. And Magically Delicious, which is what you saw a lot of blends with, um, which is Lucky Charm Cereal. It is a super sweet marshmallow amazing blend. Yes. And then lastly from that, I'm going to bust, like I chopped this a while ago. It's the Originals from Super Tarts, which is crisp pyramid leaves paired with clementine. It's actually really, really nice. What a great combination. I'm actually gonna bust into that. Um, oh, I guess I have one more little thing. Mouse ears from my friend Beth. She sent me some mouse ears, so I'm gonna do that as well. Um, all right, Rose Girls. We've got Hello Gorgeous, Bergamot, Peppermint, Pink Sugar, and Lavender. Cider Lane Pumpkin Cheesecake and Vanilla Ice Cream. Oh, and this, this one here, I have the blends for all, to, or all the mini melters to make this on my home, which I'm so glad. Uh, Winter Mermaid, Peppermint Shaving Cream and Gilligan's Brew. Yum, yum, yum. So good. And light as a feather, stiff as a board, leaves, amber, sandalwood, toasted marshmallows. All right, on to vintage chic scents. Just a few things, a couple things that didn't make it. I'll, I'll show you first of all what I didn't melt last month, which is five families won't go hungry. Five families won't go hungry. Sugar cookies, whipped cream, birthday cake, vanilla wafers, cannolis. Uh, Marshmallow zucchini bread, WB. Anyway, I think I keep messing that up too. <laughs> Grandma's pearls, marshmallow lavender vanilla. And this is my friend Sarah. I think she just didn't like this, so she sent it to me, which is super nice. Thanks, Sarah. Uh, baby Leroy, which is lavender vanilla and baby magic. Oh, and I love this one. But the only reason why I'm melting this one is because I have a full flower or a rose in it. Joanna. And that is strawberry rosemary mint shaving cream. Sweet Ferris wheel dreams. Lavender vanilla fresh picked strawberries pink sugar zucchini bread. Beautiful girl. Oh, raspberry white chocolate cheesecake, which I think I got in my mystery. My mystery box is on its way to me soon, and I think this is the loaf I got in this. Ooh, interesting. Maybe I should melt that first. It's like the rose and see if I want the whole loaf. Um, the Godfather's Ghost Hunt. Blueberry sugar cookies, whipping cream, birthday cake, vanilla wafers, cannolis. And the last little dredges, I'm just pulling things that are one-offs. I really like this one. This one's killer, you guys. It throws like crazy, I will say that. Actually, I, I know now less is more. And this one is the Glitterati White Clouds. This is amazing. <laughs> if you like laundry scents, wow. That, it's killer. It really was killer. I melted it twice now and I'm like, holy cow. Um, from Mainstays, become pumpkin cake wax cubes. These are for my friend. And from Make Sense Candle Company, we have Cookie butter crunch. Oh wait, cookie butter crack. Say no to crack, kids. Ava's country cover, pink ultimate sugar cookie. This I have to blend with this. Okay, so I have the olive branch type from Makes Sense Candle Company, it's a Canadian one, to blend with Barbershop from, well, well now it's like this, I don't know where I can't remember, anyway. Wilma's, and I normally do half of a mustache to one of the olive branch, and what an amazing blend, I love it. This I was gifted as well, Courage and Bravery from Phantoms Fairy Tales on Etsy. That's the uh, website on the top. Beth gave me Swanky Lavender Perry. And lastly, oh, I do have Hayden Rowe. There was a love spell by Hayden Rowe, which I was gifted from my friend Heather. I don't think she liked Love spell. I love it. Love it. Love it. So I'm going to break into this one here. All right, you guys. Well, there you have it.
but look at that i'm pretty i mean yeah it's a lot but there's so many one-offs like one plunk in like one plunk and one in there and i'm done kind of thing so i think i'm gonna i feel like i'm gonna get through more this month i'm gonna keep telling myself that i'm gonna get through more this month um and i'll, I'll let you know of course you will always see my empties well actually three times in a month uh the 15th ish the last day of the month and then again a wrap up of everything so there you are all right you guys as always be safe have fun take care